is the Doug Stewart Show coming to you live, real live, Friday, September 26, 2014. And thank you for joining your boy once again, the first week, the inaugural week of the Doug Stewart Show, and it's going splendid. Thank you so much for joining your boy. I really do appreciate it. Wow! Wow! So me and my producer looking at these numbers last night, and y'all are tuning in. Y'all are passing the word. Y'all are telling people. And I really do appreciate it. I really do appreciate it. Yes, 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 yes. Ha <laughs> ha. Keep telling people. All I ask is that you tell two people about the fun, the most crazy, the most devastating, interactive sports talk show online, The Doug Stewart Show. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. Got a lot we're going to get into today. Some great things we're going to talk about. Uh, we're going to talk about Derek Jeter. Ray Rice is back in the news. The NFL. Uh, you got football this weekend, obviously, with college and pro. So we're going to touch upon that. I got my man Griffey 2K calling the show today. That's right. The biggest Raider fan in the history of the world. Griffey 2K. Comedian from Atlanta. Uh, radio host. World renowned. Yeah, he's going to come on the show for Funny Friday. So every Friday, if you've never listened to the Stews before, every Friday we have on a comedian just to lighten it up a little bit, give you a little chuckle, chuckle. And so uh, Griff is going to be our first comedian on the Doug Stewart Show. All right? Yes. All right? We need sponsors. <laughs> we need sponsors. Would you like for your brand to be promoted and be a part of this show? Would you like to partner with your boy on the Doug Stewart Show? We growing. I mean, we're growing. You need to get it on the ground floor. We are growing. Yes. So uh, email me, Doug at the Doug Stewart Show dot com. You can also uh, get in contact with me uh, by text uh, at 770-847-0536. Shoot me your number and I'll have myself or uh, one of my salespeople get in contact with you. Speaking of which, we also need more salespeople. We also need more salespeople. If you've got experience or history in sales, especially radio sales, and would like to be down with the Doug Stewart Show on the ground floor, email me as well. Doug at the Doug Stewart Show dot com. And uh, man, we're doing big things over here. We're doing huge things over here. All right. I'm on Instagram. I'm on Twitter. Uh, I'm on Facebook. I got all the social networks up and running. So the best way to probably hit your boy up if you want to interact with the show and talk about some of the topics, the things that we're going to get into, the best way to do it is Twitter. And my Twitter handle is the Doug Stewart Show. That's all you got to look for is the Doug Stewart Show, and you will be live in effect on the show today. And I'll read your comments, your tweets all day long. This segment is brought to you by FanDuel. One day fantasy sports for as low as a dollar. What? Did you hear what I said? One day fantasy sports for a dollar. As low as a dollar, if you sign up with FanDuel by going on my page, the DougStewartShow.com, clicking on the link uh, on the banner, and sign up for an account, they'll match your deposit up to $200. So you put $200 in, you're getting $400 out. You're getting $400 bet with. So you can't beat that. Go to FanDuel.com uh, or go to the DougStewartShow.com and uh, sign up for FanDuel. All right? That's what we're doing. All right? 404. 404- 382-0338 is the number to the show. 404-382-0338. So obviously everybody in the world of sports is talking about Derek Jeter going out just in stupendous fashion last night, his last game in the Bronx. And they're talking about this guy like he's one of the all-time greatest New York Yankees. And I got a little list of Yankees, and I want to get your thoughts. I know how New York fans are very passionate about their sports, especially the Yankees with all the championships, over 25 World Series championships. So I know how how excited you guys are about your sports. Tell me what you think about Derek Jeter. And you know the names. Uh, you know the names, the historic names, Ruth and Mano and, and DiMaggio and all of those names. Where would you put Derek Jeter in that ranking? Um, that's what I want to talk about today. I want to Because I think Jeter, the thing about Jeter is, is he's rare in this day and time where you actually have an all-timer playing in a time period where you're watching sports. You know, all of those names that I just mentioned just now, those guys have been dead for 100 years, but their names still ring out in Yankee lore. 
So would you put Derek Jeter along with May, uh, Manol and, and Ruth and DiMaggio and those guys? Uh, I don't know if, if you're a Yankee fan. Is Reggie Jackson in that conversation? You know, he, he, I, I don't know if he is because he kind of he moved and played for a couple of different teams. He played for the California Angels, played for the A's when he first came into the league. Is, is he really regarded as one of those great Yankee players of all times? So I want to get your thoughts on that. That's the thing that kind of struck me about all of the hoopla about Derek Jeter and his last game in pinstripes in the Bronx is the fact that they're talking about this guy and you looked at his numbers and he's first in a ton of categories. The experts are talking about this guy like he's one of the all timers. Yeah, like he's one of the all timers and he is one of the all timers. Very productive at that shortstop uh, position. And what I got is a bunch of stats also. Um, that tells you some things about Derek Jeter that you may not have known. Uh, a bunch of personal facts as well. A bunch of trivia type things that you didn't know about Derek Jeter. Because anybody can talk about all of the stats and what he's done. And the fact that he's a class act. And that's the number one thing that people talk about when they talk about Derek Jeter. Is how much of a class act dude is. And clearly, based on the way that he went out there and handled his business... Every single time he put on his uniform, I think you can agree with that. Class act. Class act personified. But I got some things that I'm going to drop on you that you may not have known about Derek Jeter throughout today's show. So we'll talk about that. If you're a Yankee fan, I'd love to get you to call and give us your thoughts and, and what you were feeling last night watching uh, Derek Jeter play his last game in the Bronx. All right, The number is 404-382-0338. And the second thing we're going to do today, uh, outside of talk to Griff a little bit later and talk about all of these sports and preview these games and we'll hit Monday Night Football and there's some new news out on Ray Rice, uh, we're also going to have a Dougie Daly. All right, your Dougie Daly today is who is your favorite or your all-time or who do you think is in a conversation for all-time Southern rappers? That's right. Yes, who do you think should be in the conversation for all-time greatest rappers. The reason we came up with this topic, this Dougie Daly, is because the great outcast is performing this week, and it's like their reunion tour. Dre and Big Boy, they're back together again. Not that they ever were separated, but you know how them guys are. Them guys are kind of strange. You know, and, uh, them guys are kind of different, so they off doing their own things. Dre's doing movies, uh, uh, Big boys doing TV uh, uh, and movies as well, smaller movies, B movies, and those guys. So they're kind of different. They're kind of eccentric, but they're back together this weekend, performing live all weekend long in Centennial Park downtown ATL. So they've been touring already, but this is like the the coup de gras because this is Atlanta. Okay, this is this is where they put their names in lights right here in the ATL. So Outkast is performing this weekend. So that got us to thinking. Who's the greatest Southern rapper of all time? Or who would you put in that list? And I guess we, we probably just need to say that Outkast is number one. So my question, I guess, is number two. Or if you disagree with me, if you, okay, give me your thoughts on Outkast, your favorite Outkast moment, or why you love their music so much. Or tell us somebody you think is better than Outkast. We're talking Southern rappers. No New York today. No, no, no West Coast. No, no. No, uh, no, no Midwest. We're talking South, the dirty South, because I think when most people think about rappers in the South, I think most people kind of agree that the best duo group uh, team rapper is Outkast and the best rapper, the best single guy from the South is Andre 3000. I think most people agree with that. You may disagree. You may disagree. So I want to get your thoughts on that as well. 404-382-0338. I'm going to read also in, uh, throughout today's show one of these lists with the top 10 greatest Southern rappers of all times uh, and groups of all times. And right now, they've got number 10, 3-6 Mafia. And the reason I'm going by this, this list, and you know they always have a bunch of different lists on different topics. The reason I'm going with this list is because this is the list that I pretty much agreed with, with the most part, for the most part. And they had 3-6 Mafia at number 10, okay? Straight from Memphis, 3-6, Juicy J, Lord Infamous, DJ Paul, uh, Juicy J. 
uh, you know, Tater Club up. If you remember when Tater Club came out, that thing just took over like crazy. That was like the hottest track. And really, Tater Club up kind of changed uh, the sound of hip hop because you start having that real dirty, like, like hardcore top type Southern rap. I think 3-6 Mafia is kind of like one of the, 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 the groups that kind of put that to the forefront. And, you know, and you can talk about, you know, the Ghetto Boys and, and, uh, and uh, you know, some other groups before them probably. But, yeah, 3-6 Mafia definitely should be included because their legacy. They've done a lot in the game, man. They've done a lot in the game. Uh, big time producers. You know, they, uh, they produce the uh, soundtrack for Hustle and Flow. What was it? It's hard out here for a pimp. You remember that? We'll never forget that. And we're not going to play it today because I'm not paying for their music. Okay? And I got a couple emails from people saying, you know, I like your music, man. But, you know, why don't you play some Outkast when you're talking about Outkast? Or why don't you play some, some Michael Jackson when you talk about Michael Jackson or, or, or Prince? And uh, I can't do that right now. Okay? Because we on a budget. I'm keeping it real. Now, I can come on here and fake and, and, and try to act like I'm all tough and bad, big willy nilly, and like I'm like I'm ESPN, like I'm the Puppet Factory, or, or I'm CBS or something like that. But it, it it's just not like that. I just keep it real. So right now we using this nice free hip hop music. <laughs> yes, free hip hop music. Okay. Until I get some sponsors in here, until we start taking this thing to the next level financially, we gonna just have to do with this. That's right. That's right. Hit your boy up. 404-382-0338 is the number to the show. That's 404-382-0338 is the number to the show. This is the Doug Stewart Show, and we are having fun. We're talking Derek Jeter. When we get back, I'll tell you some Derek Jeter little facts that you may not have known. We'll take your phone calls. We'll have fun. We'll do the damn thing. Don't go anywhere. Keep it locked to the Doug Stewart Show. The Doug Stewart Show is off and running, but just like every company, we need sponsors. Would you like to work with one of the livest, most dynamic, and recognized sports talk show personalities in America? By the way, that's me. Getting in on the ground floor? Well, call us at 770-847-0536 or email me at Doug at thedougstewartshow.com and let's do business. From the smallest company in Atlanta to the biggest brands nationally and worldwide, shouty. People know me and the Stews brand in these streets. I'll let you vote. Once again, the number is 770-847-0536 or email me at Doug at the Doug Stewart Show.com. Yes! This is your folk, Doug Stewart. Want to protect you and your family from life's unexpected mishaps? Then join 7. Join 7 is a prepaid legal company under the umbrella of the Protection Group. Join 7 is the only group benefit or motor club in the U.S. that offers auto reimbursement coverage, key replacement coverage, roadside assistance, gives you a current metafile, prescription savings, and a fully encompassed prepaid legal benefit that includes identity theft. They got your back. The average combined cost to purchase these benefits individually is over 850 bucks a year. Join today and take advantage of all 7 for $17 a month. They've been around for over 20 years, so check them out by clicking on the banner link on my page, thedougstewartshow.com, or the app. Just go ahead and join 7. I'm always saying get with the times. Stop acting like you at your mama house, calling that girl you met at summer camp two states away, and your mama screaming out, I know you better not be talking long just as running up my bill with that little hussy girl. Well, get with the times with the long distance charges. Presenting Univon. Univon offers unlimited worldwide calling to 60 plus countries for $14.99 a month. No contract, no activation fee, and no cancellation fee. Users can call anytime using their mobile phone or home IP phone. So stop flushing money down the drain. Get more details by clicking Univon's link banner on the DougStewartShow.com or the link on the DougStewartShow.com app. Try out Univon and call your peoples like you not at your mama house. Sports talk with hot sauce, Texas Pete hot sauce. This is the Doug Stewart Show. And thank you very much for joining me once again. Day number five, the week has gone by like, like crazy. 